Hey guys, Ron Callis again. I am here at Atlanta Audio and Automation in Atlanta, uh, uh, Georgia. I was about to say Atlanta, Florida, but it's not Florida. It's Atlanta, Georgia. Are we actually, what's the exact city we're in, Cheryl? We're in Atlanta. We're, we're in Buckhead. Atlanta. We're in Buckhead. Okay, so uh, I'm going to flip the camera around here, folks, and I've got Cheryl. She's the uh, proud owner of this fine establishment, and I'm just going to say hello. Hello there. Hey, Cheryl, how are you today? Very good. Thanks for uh, coming to visit our, our showroom. Awesome. Well, thanks for having us. Cheryl, can we uh, show our, our fans here on our One Firefly page? Uh, can we give them a quick tour of your new beautiful showroom? Sure. Let's, uh, let's get going. All right. So we're walking in the front door here, and um, this is a, a beautiful, big, what is that, a 75-inch? That's an 85 LG. An 85-inch LG. Now, is that an OLED? No. Nope. That one is just their regular okay. 85. This one over here would be the OLED. It's oh, this is OLED. this is the OLED. Okay, now I'm gonna I'm gonna not go too far. This is your office back here, right? So mm -hmm. This is where all the the magic happens and the deals close yeah. and you run the operation. Okay. Now I see right here at um, as we walk in, this looks like your designer section. What's yeah. What's going on here? We have all the uh, Lutron binders for shading, uh, and then our seating from Palliser to a couple of the brands that we do. Okay. Um, so we have some Lutron, looks like shade binders. Yes. Looks like we have wood frame. Wood frames for Siora and Frame My TV, and okay. a couple of the brands for uh, picture uh, TVs and mirror TVs. Okay. So when you have uh, client meetings, you're going to clear this off and roll out plans and, and sit with your, your, your customers or, or design uh, trade folks here? Yes. That's why we have these big tables so we can open up plans and have enough room to, to work with our, with our clients. Okay, cool. What do we have going on over here? We just have a, a room here, surround sound. We have a TV here that's a picture TV, so you can design a... Ooh, can um, we do a quick demo of that? Sure. Is this, uh, uh, what product is this? This is a Frame My TV. Frame My TV, okay. Can we turn it, up, turn it off and then you get, there you go. That's cool. Now, can your customer choose the art? Yep, they can choose any picture they want and they can change, choose the frame they want as well. It's very covert, huh? Oh, that's beautiful. So there's a box. And you can, you can inset it as well. It can be recessed. You can recess it. Mm -hmm. Okay. And so the, your client, you're doing some light surround sound here with a, a, a center and then a couple of uh, a left and a right? Yep. Okay, cool. Love it. All right. What do we have next? So you we got a... Our Sonos demo area here. That is pretty bright. That is cool. Are you finding Sonos is still pretty popular with your customers? Yes, everybody knows about Sonos, so... I have to have it. Well, they often come in asking about Sonos. Absolutely, they do. Yeah. They do. Okay, what do we want to look at here? We'll look, look at... We've got our uh, man cave over here. Man cave. Arr, arr, arr. I'll channel my inner... Was it Tim, the tool man Taylor? <laughs> <laughs> Going back a little bit. Okay, cool. So and we have... It's a popular setup. Okay, so you're finding that, that folks want to do like a main screen and then, a, a, I guess, additional content on these uh, surrounding screens? Yes, this is for sports. Most of the guys that, guys that want this, it's they, for sports. <laughs> they want to be watching multiple games yeah. at once. Okay. All right. And then uh, right over here, this is where you're demoing a lot of the hidden technologies, right? Yes. Ooh, can you show the, the true fig demo you have here? Sure, this is demo. a... Pick uh, it up in the light. The true fig demo would be, this is a, a solid surface, marble, or some kind of kitchen counter. And then we put the light plates. Well, this is an electrical plate, but you can have light plates or just anything. And then this is a piece of plastic um, from uh, how do you get it to How do you get it to match? Because it's, it's almost it, exactly. And this is magnetic. And then you have a faux painter paint the plastic and it goes right over the top and it kind of blends in and then you can even hide it all together and put a blank plate on it so when you're in a really nice kitchen and they don't they have to have plates for code reasons oh, so you could just cover it up you if they just, don't plan to use the outlets right exactly and then if you if you move it back a little you can't even see 
Yeah, well, that, that is even there. It's not showing up on the camera no. at all. And so over here, you're showing a, a pop-up TV? Yep, a pop-up TV, and then, you know, if it goes down, it's flush with the counter, and it could disappear right into the counter. How do, how do customers react when they see this demo actually happen? Well, they, they really like it, because if they don't want to have stuff, you know, they want a minimalistic kind of, um, of, of look in their house, you can hide technology, and they just don't know about it. You're this sure. one goes up into the ceiling. Okay. You that's... know, and then we show the Sonance. We do architectural speakers here. Very tiny. There's a subwoofer. The center one is a subwoofer. It looks like a speaker. Oh, wow. So the sound on this is really phenomenal. Yeah, it must. I can tell you guys, you uh, uh, can't smell it, but this place also smells great. So I think anybody that comes in here would, you know, really feel at home. All right. So we're going to uh, put my hand in front of the camera and keep moving here. You want to go into our outdoor area? Yeah, let's do outdoor. Guys, it, uh, it is just stunning in here. It's really warm and welcoming. Here you got a little ceiling fan. You know, and everything in here is uh, powered by Control 4. So we can demo the lights, the shades, the audio, the video, the fans door locks, anything that you can think of. What speakers do you have going yeah, on over here? This is a Sonyan speaker. So these are the garden speakers for the sub. I don't know, it's kind of dark. In yeah, it's kind of dark, it's kind of dark in here. You can see it hiding over there underneath the plant. But well, I guess that's the whole purpose of outdoor audio, right? Yeah. Is to have it blend in. You want to in. hear it. You don't have to see it. You want to, you want to hear it, not see it. That's beautiful. And so I see you put, you know, manufacturer brochures around, I guess, for products that are applicable yeah. to that area. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's like you got a bunch of chairs back there. Is that for events? Yeah, we do events here, industry uh, meetings and things like that. Okay, cool. Do you do stuff with the, uh, the architects or interior designers? Do you do regular trainings and events? We, try, we try to when, okay. we, when we have some interest in that kind of thing. We do. Got it. Now, back... Here, I know everyone wants to see the theater, but let's, uh, I see something has caught my eye back here. First of all, we've got uh, the back of our rack and equipment. It's going on here. I'm betting we see the front of that from the theater, right? Yes, you can see it from the theater. Okay, and then over here, this is a, uh, a demonstration area where they're showing demonstration uh, engineering work. Uh, do you have folks, do they, do they look at this content? Yeah, I mean, they, they, they come over here and they do look at it. Yeah, that's cool. That's back to the, some of those demos back to the legacy days of one firefly doing engineering. <laughs> <laughs> and this is our two channel room. Okay. Okay, so you've got just a beautiful record collection over here. Do folks listen to a lot of vinyl? Do they come in wanting to? Specific, particular customers do. Particular they, customers yes. do. And there's the, uh, is that chair where the, that's the sweet spot? That's where people yep. sit and mm -hmm. you turn the lights off and they go into their place of zen. All right, cool. All right, and what do we have over here? In here so we have Probably not going to be able to see this because it's so dark, but look at that beautiful blue sky. Okay, and then over here... You can see the equipment rack. So, now does that does yeah, that also these, light not light up? This is uh, doors. We kind of hit it with smoke glass in uh, here because we don't okay. want the lights to take away from the theater room. Right. But you know, people like to look at racks. So. Oh yeah, blink the cool light factor, the CLF. So I that you can come in here and you can look at the racks from the front. Oh, that's cool. And I acknowledge, guys. I know it's a little bit dark. Hey, there's Matt Callis. That's my brother. What's up, Matt? Hope you're enjoying this live feed. So you can see people as they join in. Oh, is that fun? <laughs> yeah. He's checking, checking you out, seeing He's what you're checking, doing. He's checking me out, seeing what we're doing. So what sort of technology, Cheryl, are we demonstrating in this room? This is the Dolby Atmos uh, sound technology and, and video technology. We have uh, Sony's, uh, Sony projectors, a screen innovation screen in here. I think, I don't even know. Do how. clients come in here and just not want to leave? They, that's very, that's true. <laughs> that would be, that that's would... the idea, honestly. <laughs> that's, that's cool, man. And so what sort of projector is, I know no one can see it, but there is a, 
actually a projector up here. What what sort That's of projector, projector is that? Sony projector. Okay. Yeah, that's beautiful. All right, well. So we're running our theater with paradigm speakers all the way around. And then we do have, even though it's hard to see, we have the electrostatic uh, Martin Logan speakers I guess we in probably here. could turn the lights sure, on. We and can just... do that. There you go. There we go. So now everyone can see where we're doing. There's that. You still can't see that Sony projector. There, I see the logo Sony. And uh, the image is absolutely stunning. Now, these speakers are, I know a lot of the integrators will know this, but this is maybe for some a bit of a unique concept and that that's an electrostatic film, right? Yep. So what, what brand is this, this again? This is Martin Logan. This is Martin. You can look at that, guys. You can see through the speaker. And so what they're doing is they're actually uh, vibrating that film at such a rate and uh, it produces pretty stunning sound. And then down there you have the subwoofer. Awesome. All right, Cheryl, let's look. Where's the back office? Where do you... Uh, oh, we're going over here. We're going to go over here. This is one of our two warehouses. So, guys, this is the less sexy stuff, but this is kind of uh, the, 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 the side of the operation where the business is done. Yeah. So we have, you know, uh, product, and what we're going to do is we're going to go over what's... Uh, I'm gonna so what Cheryl found when they moved into this space is they were growing at such a rate that they quickly outgrew this space for storage and, and products. And so they uh, were very fortunate in that next door they had a California Closets and that California Closet moved out of their uh, space, uh, at least in terms of the warehouse space, and they were able to add that to the mix. So now hey, this wonderful branding on uh, uh, the roll-up door uh, which is pretty cool. And then they have, uh, they were able to convert this whole space into warehousing uh, for their product mix. So I'm actually going to just take a quick peek. Uh, we'll just give you a quick sneak peek. So here you can see this is where the magic's done. They've got that, that great roll up door so their crews can, they can roll that up, load gear into the, the vehicles. They're able to get pallets dropped off and really have an efficient back office. So, all right, let's, uh, we're going to wrap it up. We're going to roll back to the, the front of the space. Uh, for those of you that didn't watch the video about an hour ago, I'm just going to show again the front of the facility. So Atlanta Audio and Automation. So they're in this great design district. So there's all these different facilities over here that serve interior designers. They sell furniture, architectural shops. And then here they are, you can see them on this beautiful storefront and uh, just great signage, great visibility. And uh, I hope everyone, I hope everyone enjoyed this uh, quick uh, uh, demo and walkthrough and Cheryl, thank you thank so you for much. Coming. Yeah, thank you so much Cheryl for letting us uh, uh, kind of show the behind the scenes of your operation uh, with all of our fans. Thank you. All right. Bye, everyone. Signing off.